What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Ziggy. We back in here with another Nerdcore reaction for y'all. And this one's to the homie Aizen Senpai. And this is Aizen Senpai Have Hot, Have Cold, a Shoto AMV. Now, basically, you know Shoto Todoroki from My Hero Academia. And from what I saw on his Twitter, like on his social media or so, where he talked about this, saying about how the fact that for the f even basically showing like appreciation or so, in a way you can say to his fans, to his day ones and such. Now, I'll admit, even though I learned about Eisen from like months ago or so, just from one of my from one of my episodes of Anime Wednesdays and such. Shout out to JB for that. But with the more of his music I've listened to and such, even when it's just the ones that he's been dropping lately. Sorry, a little burp. You get a sense of how I like like music that like gives me like soul and such. Or well, like gives me pop vibes where you just want to dance it out into it. Cause, like I said, we do have a lot of rapping. We have rock music. We have R and B. But do we have ever have like pop music in nerdcore? So shout out to Eisen. And even though I just joined the Vibe Society like a month and a half ago or so, glad to be part of it. So either way, we better check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and without further ado, let's get in the video. Hey. Okay, now I can see where he's gonna go with this, cause if you watch to you if you know the backstory of how Todoroki is and such, with the way how he's coming up and such, that yeah, at one point it's crazy that he would think that he would never be here and such, and the fact that with his peers from UA, like from in a way you can say Bakugo, cause he wants the competitive side, but throughout everybody else. You see that he sh that the peer his peers and such shows him love and such that he's glad that he's here and such because with his type of quirk he can go great beyonds with it with being a hero while his father let's face it I know there's a lot of people who wants to be saying it's like fancy or whatnot and such do their own expression me I'm gonna just say it the ghettoest way as possible he was a dick. <laughs> Straight up, he was being a plain old dick to his son and to his family too. Like basically, like Drew, because for many years that when people have always said about Endeavor being the number two hero, and the fact that All Might was the number one hero and such, aka known as the symbol of peace. Shoto, I mean not Shoto, he, Endeavor wanted his, one of his family members or so to be the one to pass, like, my own mic. Sorry, I gotta eat, I'm eating crackers, so I'm hungry, so yeah. But, with that determination in, um, in Endeavor's mind, he don't see that he's making his sons, even though he was like very young, going through all this and such, like dude, at the end of the day, I don't care if it's for, at the end of the day to me it's like this, you, 
you putting way too much pressure on your son that even though he has a quirk he's still a little kid at the end of the day you treating him way you making him doing this stuff way too early way too early sometimes I'm so I don't even feel it control. I got water running from my nose forward is the only way to go all this heat on me I feel like I might crack next up but I'm Class 1A, and yeah, this is the way now Todoroki start accepting it. Cause like I said, look, I said I might take it a different way, but then again, a lot of people would. But the fact that now that this is more of, you can say I'm more of Aizen more than Todoroki, cause well, actually, trust me, I, I'm a what. After the end of this song, I'm going to read the description down below. And trust me, that would give it a far more better than how I can be able to explain it. So, Just hit me with the vocals like that already, man. Already with the vocals. You know, you know that's a, I'm a sucker for the vocals. I'm a look here. I'm a sucker to the day that I'm not a sucker no more for the vocals. Cause God damn it, the vocals be on point when it comes to you, guys. I got water running from my by my own flesh and blood and never like I said he was being an ass and I would say it's more to his family some of his family too but let's face it it was because of Endeavor that he did like how you know how effed up that is that the fact that your own flesh and like your father and such was wanted to train you hard as hell not training you like properly or whatever but training you hard as hell to know that you didn't even know that you had a brother and sister. That's how a dick, that's how much of a dick Endeavor was. And for goodness sakes, to how because of his own goddamn mother that throw a freaking kettle and hot kettle on him hence why you see the scar he has on his face like on this side of his face so trust me yeah but if you get, if you watch more and more of the show you get to see how he's trying to trying to get along
Aizen, you did your thing on this one. And now, like I promise, just to show you how much, in a way, this song resonates more with Aizen and such, like, I'm gonna read you the description of it. So, basically, this description reads that shout out to the Vibe Society, Vibe Society's community. I'm so glad that you, you've all been here with me. It's crazy to think that back on times where I had to beg people to listen, meaning 2012 when he started, as you see, now people are waiting for songs to drop, to come out, basically his songs, like literally right now. So shout out to you that I'm a member of the Vibe Society. Although this truly isn't the beginning, it definitely feels like a new chapter in my manga called Life. That's a that's a bar right there. Ain't even that. Just started. Sometimes it brings me to tears because I've made a lot of mistakes and I'm still in atoning for some and that makes me feel like Shoto. Yep. I mean, cause, and plus we all do too. So at the end of the day, sometimes we try to make amends for them. <clears throat> Having experienced abuse, grudges with that and his wonderful abilities that he doesn't recognize but his peers do like i was just talking about how he got these great quirk powers and such that even though his father don't even though he don't think he recognize it but trust me his classmates at ua they definitely do they had his back like y'all had his back and he means that with y'all and he appreciates that God has given me the opportunity to really experience life from the worst of times to the best of times. For my absolute day ones to my haters, I love all of y'all. I hope y'all, I hope you find your way on this scary, ugly, depressing, help, helpless yet wonderful, joyous, giving, beautiful world of yin and yang. For the ones who, for the ones involved directly or indirectly a special thanks to y'all god made my burdens my burdens weightless thank you now basically with that all i gotta say is hey eisen even though you say like this is just a new chapter in saw bro at the end of the day keep on doing what you're doing because trust me i know myself too like when I started like doing this YouTube stuff, like start dropping music videos of my own, I honest to God, I never thought I would do this and such, cause or actually like be doing something with my life. Cause basically at the end of the day, you never know what's gonna happen in your life. Cause like look at me. I never know I thought I would be here. And when I mean like here, I didn't know what my life would come to. Like if for 20, like I've said this many times and people can recognize with me. But Aizen, I never said, you never heard from me saying this, but it's like this. 2014, right? From 2014 to now, I've been part of the U.S. But people know me. I'm Jamaican. Never, and I never knew what could be... Basically, if it wasn't for my mom and such, like the many times y'all always see her come in here and such, at the end of the day, I gotta remember, at the end of the day, if it wasn't for her, my sister and such, trying to make us come here with me, my, me and my dad, come here to the U.S., so that way we can all be together, trust me, y'all wouldn't have gotten me here, y'all wouldn't have seen me here doing these videos and such, and shoot, for me, I would not know what to expect, I would not know what to do. I would not know how my life would have been different if I would have stayed in Jamaica, but at the end of the day, I always think like this would be because it would be basically new, like you like you said, a new chapter and such. This would have been a new chap. This was a new chapter in my life because throughout my entire life, it was in Jamaica, but since I had to leave Jamaica, I came here to do a new, better opportunities and such. Sorry that this was a long, that was a long one and such, but I'm glad that he was saying like this was like a new chapter in his life, and kind of somewhat, like kind of somewhat in a way with me too. But hey, Eisen, 
shout out to you bro keep on doing what you're doing man keep on throwing up these good bank these bangers man and make sure y'all go subscribe to the man where he at now he's at like 40 look he's almost close to that 5k so trust me run it up for the, for the man let him get to that 5k and then to that 10k because trust me he's putting in that working and let me know what y'all thought about this reaction down in the comments below it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out stay positive and keep the vibes up let go